Hey guys, how's it going? This is Boxman from Dark Obsidian 1 bringing you another video and this is going to be different from my normal recap videos I bring y'all because this is going to be a new series focused on attacking anti 3 star bases. This is going to be the first episode starting with this Town 9 base and uh, the first thing I do when I see these bases is I look at the queen positioning. You see she's right there, she's got some storages around her, she's got an expo and an air sweeper next to her, an air defense pretty close by. Then you want to look at the Expos and you see he's got both of them kind of kind of close but kind of far covering most of the base. They're on, they're on ground and air. And then he's got these uh, air defenses over here that are all grouped up so tight which is very nice for an air raid. And that's why I decided to go with an air raid on this base. And uh, let me erase these annotations. Okay, so decided to start with uh, Gollum at that mortar. and. Uh, I could have placed a golem like that, but if I did, this archer tower would have shot any kind of wizard that I would have put down there for the funnel. So I started more like this, that way the archer tower would hit the golem as well, and that way I can put some wizards right around here to start the funnel. And then uh, I had a minion down here because there's nothing that can target the minion. Uh, it looks like I only had one. I can't remember for sure if I had it on the builder hut or the elixir pump, but it was down here to help cut out the funnel. And then uh, a couple more wizards right here as well. And then uh, once this stuff goes down, I decided to go with some Valks and some boulders to get through those storages pretty quick and to get through that queen and expo pretty quick. Uh, the main reason why I went with Valks is because of those storages. And uh, I decided to go with a jump spell entry for that queen because the queen is right there exposed to an outer wall. And so I came in with the jump spell about right there. We're going to thinking that, there we go, now you can see it. Okay, so we had the jump spell there. I'm gonna send in my kill squad, which is gonna be my king. Oops, let me turn that into an arrow. All right, so kill squad comes in like that. It's gonna be Valks, Bowlers, and my heroes. And there, uh, I'm gonna use a rage spell and a heal spell to keep them alive around that queen with all that expo fire coming at them. So, and, and there's a wizard tower as well, which is also important. So, oops, try that again. All right, so rage spell roughly right there. We're gonna have a heal spell about right there as well. And then uh, we'll draw a line through this base. And basically I wanted the kill squad to take out about this much of the base. Or even like right there would have been fine as well if they didn't get that expo down. And uh, that's why I wasted three spells in my kill squad and I brought a big kill squad. I really wanted to try to get as much as I could for them. And then we're going to come in with the loon portion. We'll go with black for the hounds. The loon portion coming in with the hound here, the hound here. And uh, since they're only level 6 air defense, I only brought two hounds. I could have brought three if I needed to. We're going to have the loons come in from the behind the hounds right there. One for that mortar, some more for the wizard, more for the mortar. And then we're going to use uh, haste spells to get through these little wizard towers right here pretty quick. And then we're going to use another haste spell to get through the air defense pretty quick to get them onto that second air defense. And then we're going to have a couple more loons saved back for the back end. Roughly like right here and maybe right there once uh, the hounds start taking the damage from that air defense. And that is pretty much it guys. Let's go ahead and get on the replay and see how it went.
If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. Uh, let us know what you think in the comments. Subscribe to our channel so you get notifications about our next videos. Check out our website, thedarkobsidian.com. We post gym contests and a bunch more stuff there. Check out our Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. And we'd love to hear from you guys. Hit us up anytime. And I will see you guys in the next video.